Today, we are building an Arduino powered joystick controlled wheelchair. This project allows us to control the movement of the wheelchair using a simple joystick model. Let's start with the components used in this project. One Arduino Uno board brain of the system, joystick module for directional control, next the L298N motor driver module responsible for driving the motors and providing speed control, two DC geared motors with wheels, one caster wheel, some jumper wires, one USB cable, a double battery holder with a switch, two rechargeable batteries, cardboards for the structure of the wheelchair. Now how does it work? The joystick has two axes, X and Y. Moving the joystick forward, backward, left or right sends analog signal to the Arduino. Based on these signals, the Arduino decides the direction and controls the two DC motors via l 290 and motor driver. This makes the wheelchair move forward, backward, left or right depending on the user input. Now let's make a wheelchair structure like using the cardboard. Let's quickly look at the connection. Take the DC geared motors, paste them like this, take the motor driver. The l 290 and motor driver has two outputs and leveled as out1, out2, out3 and out4. Now take the positive wire of motor 1, insert it to output 1 of the motor driver, then take the other wire that is negative of motor 1 and insert it in output 2. Similarly connected the positive of the second motor to output 3 and negative to output 4. Now paste the battery holder here. Insert this red wire in the plus 12 volt slot. Similarly insert the black wire in the ground slot of the motor driver. Now fix the Arduino board here. First of all power the Arduino from the motor driver. To do so insert one wire from plus 5 volt salt of motor driver or to the VI in pin of the Arduino and insert one wire from GND of the motor driver to the GND of Arduino. Now insert male to female jumper wires in these pins. Connect the enable A and enable B pin to two PWM pins on the Arduino which means pulse width modulation pins. Here I am connecting it to pin number 9 and 10 respectively. These pins will control the speed of the motors. Connect the IN1 pin of the motor driver to D4 of Arduino. Connect the IN2 pin of the motor driver to D5 of Arduino. Connect IN3 pin of the motor driver to D6 of Arduino. Connect the IN4 pin of the motor driver to D7 of Arduino. Now take the joystick. By using jumper wires, connect the joystick VCC pin to the 5V pin on the Arduino. Connect the joystick GND pin to the GND pin on the Arduino. Connect VRX means horizontal to E0 on the Arduino. Connect VRY means vertical to E1 on the Arduino. Make sure to double check your connection with the circuit diagram. Now our circuit is ready and we need to add the code. Download the code file given in the description below. Open the code file if you have already downloaded the Arduino ID, otherwise download the Arduino ID first. The joystick module has two analog outputs. First we define the pin connection for the joystick and motor driver module. The joystick has two axes X and Y. We connect them to analog pin A0 and A1. The motor driver has input pins for controlling two DC motors. Next in the setup function we define the pin modes up for the motor driver and set the initial speed. We set joystick pin as input and motor driver pin as output. Then we set the motor speed using analog write. It's change speed our requirement. In the loop function we read the joystick values using analog read function. The joystick values range from 0 to 1023. If the joystick is near the center, we consider it has no movement using a threshold. Now we check the joystick position and control the motors accordingly. Forward movement, joystick up, backward movement, joystick down, turning left, joystick left, turning right, joystick right. Stopping the motor joystick center. Now let's look at the function that controls the motor. Move forward, move backward, turn left, turn right, stop motors. The stop motors function ensures that the wheelchair stops when no input is detected. Now let's upload our code to the Arduino. Connect our Arduino Uno to your computer using a USB cable. Select port and board in the Arduino IDE. Click the upload button. Once the upload is complete, Let's test the project. Now insert the batteries in the holder, attach the wheels in motors. Now paste the caster wheel here as per the stability of the wheelchair. And that's how our project works. By moving the joystick in different direction, we send signal to the Arduino to control the motors via L298 in driver. This allows the wheelchair to move forward, backward, left or right based on joystick movement. I hope you find this tutorial helpful. Thanks for watching RoboArmy.